Today's video is going to be about the champions in my GM mode and how to get more than just the world champions for the men's and women's division. So smash that like button, hit the notification bell. Let's get straight into the video. So how do we set up the tag team titles? Well, I've got two unbooked matches right here. So we are going to go straight over to tag team. We are going to then choose Ronda Rousley and we are then going to choose Dolan as one team. So we've got a heel team representing here. Then we are going to go to Bianca Belair and then we are going to go to Dana Brooke. So you can see these two right here pair perfectly with Ronda Rousley. And because Dolan is a heel and she is a specialist, this should be a very, very good show. Once you guys have got your contestants, go down to title match and it should say off and you can scroll over and press tag. Now this is a women's tag team title match and this should help massively when it comes to your ratings. You can do the same when it comes to the men's division. So let's choose Randy Orton right here and Matt Riddle. So I've got a fighter and a specialist, both fan favorites. And then what we could do is make sure that we have got two heel specialists against each other. It's not the best result. The best result would probably be another bruiser or two bruisers against Randy Orton and two fighters against the two bruisers. That could be the best result. But if you guys want to go to title match, you can then press tag title match and that's that done. So you now have your tag team set up. So to set up your Intercontinental Championship, we are going to go to our unbooked right here and we are going to go with a one on one. And unfortunately, I haven't got a heel. I've only got a fan favorite. So I have luckily got a specialist and a fighter. So hopefully Tyler Bay and Damian Priest can put on a good show. But once you guys have got your two superstars in this situation, you're going to scroll down and it says title match. Then you scroll over and it says men's title match. And now this is going to be the third title match of this show. And obviously you can finish this however you guys wanted to. So if we wanted to have the women's um, WWE Championship as your main event, that could be how it goes down for you. Whatever you guys wanted to do, just make sure that... You just realize that the WWE Tag Team Championships doesn't have to be a be all or end all. Same as the United States Championship or the Intercontinental Championship, whatever it is. If you guys just wanted to make sure that Damian Priest wins and he gets that popularity boost, you can do that. Same with this. If I wanted to make sure Ronda Rousey wins and she gets that extra popularity boost, I definitely can do that. So I highly suggest that you guys do this very early on to give yourself that popularity boost for your roster as much as you can. And if you are in a situation such as I am here where I've only only got two fan favorites you can just make sure that you do a role change to get the perfect pairing and promo skills unfortunately doesn't improve throughout the game but that is something you guys have to consider when you are trying to pick up each wrestler they all have different promo skill ratings and this can change massively so make sure you look at that before you guys picking up each wrestler and that is pretty much it. Once you guys have got yourself set up like this, you're in a good situation. Popularity should definitely increase throughout the game. And this is going to help you so, so much at the start of any season. So be sure to smash that like button, hit the notification bell. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.